Hello, greetings everyone. My name is Shashi Ishwaran and I am an alumnus of Thrissur Engineering College, a fellow GECTN. I know most of you don't know me and, and frankly some of you may not give a damn about me. So fortunately for all of us, this is not about me. This is about a person who in, in her short life has touched the lives of so many people. This is about Gloria Krishna Kumar, ne Gloria Gobi, my friend. Gloria was an alumnus of Thrissur Engineering College. She and I were contemporaries in college, albeit we were in different streams of study. Uh, my memories of her during the college days were that of a, a very bright and sprightly girl in her teens. After graduating from college, um, she rather quickly moved to the United States to be with her husband, Krishnan. She came from a, a thoroughly middle class background, just like the most of us. Yet uh, she rose through the ranks thanks to her academic brilliance and hard work. And she um, worked in one of the most well-known companies in Silicon Valley, the Intel Corporation. It was a few years later that I met Gloria at her residence in Silicon Valley, uh, in San Jose to be specific. But instantly I could recall the bubbly Gloria from college days. I felt an instant connection to co the college uh, from her voice and her character characteristic Trishur accent. A few of us felt more at home abroad, uh, thanks to the wonderful evening that Gloria hosted in her house for us. Gloria um, lived in the San Francisco Bay Area, where she was the central point of many connections among GECTNs. She could walk into a room and immediately light up the room, brighten up the room, regardless of the number of people gathered. She would engage everyone in conversation with the genuine passion and interest. It won't be much of a hyperbole to say that Gloria was the binding force uh, of many Bay Area get-togethers among GECT members. Even decades after leaving college, uh, she held her fondness for the college so dearly that she had insisted that I join her in a fundraising campaign for building the college auditorium. Later, some friends of mine and I joined hands to found the GECT Development Trust. There too, Gloria was instrumental in rallying the troops and helping the GECT Development Trust and its various initiatives. Sadly, uh, Gloria has left us too soon, but she has not left without making an impact. Just like she touched the lives of so many while she was alive, her legacy lives through in, um, in college thanks to the generosity of her husband Krishnan and kids Sita and Rohit. The GECT SAFE scholarship and the alumni hall are just two examples that remind us, um, remind those, especially those who haven't met Gloria that such a wonderful person had once walked up and down the hallowed corridors of our college. Um, so I, I hope I tried to convey to you what a remarkable person um, Gloria was and how well liked and, um, uh, she was. And um, it's not just the outward uh, demeanor of her, but the innermost beauty uh, of her, um, uh, you know, actions, the, the, the caring and the, um, uh, and the ability to um, engage everyone in a deep conversation and later on to the ability to recall those conversations. So they show that, that she genuinely cared about everybody. And I hope that is um, something that we all can take with us uh, uh, from her. And, um, and, and that is one way to uh, pay a tribute to her. Um, and, um, that's pretty much all I can say at this point about Gloria. And I, I, mean, I surely do miss her, just like many of uh, her friends um, uh, feel the same way. Um, but. Um, as they say, c'est la vie, but um, Gloria, um, you, you still um, uh, are missed. Thank you.